Hello everyone, this is Joao from Ken Hub and welcome to another anatomy tutorial where this time we're going to be talking about the renal cortex. What I'm going to be doing is exploring this structure that belongs to, of course, as the name indicates, the kidney. But to do so, as you can see here on this image, we just removed the upper half of the organ. So in a mid longitudinal section. And then we're going to also remove the lower part on other images. But right now we're looking at the left kidney from a posterior view. On this tutorial, we're going to be talking about the renal cortex and also the related structures. And as you probably know, the kidneys are bilateral organs of the urogenital system. They are located in the retroperitoneal region of the abdomen, and their main function is to eliminate excess bodily fluid, salts, and byproducts of protein metabolism. Now the main body of the kidneys can be divided functionally into a cortex, a renal medulla, and the hilum. And in this tutorial we will discuss the renal cortex and other related structures. Now as you can see here in this section of the kidney we see the renal cortex highlighted in green, which is then the outer layer of the body of the kidney found between this structure which is known as the fibrous capsule of the kidney and also the renal medulla. This outer layer is an estimated six millimeters in thickness and ultra filtration occurs in the renal cortex. Now structures found in the renal cortex include the renal corpuscles, the distal renal tubules, and the proximal renal tubules. The next structures that we're going to be seeing here highlighted in green now on the image are known as the renal columns. And the renal columns are extensions of the renal cortex that extend down between the pyramids of the renal medulla. And these renal columns contain urinary tubules and blood vessels. Now I'm ready to move to the next one, the next structures here highlighted, which are known as the bases of the renal pyramids. The base of each renal pyramid is located between the renal cortex and the renal pyramids at the corticomedullary border. The renal pyramids are formed by the renal medulla, which is the next structure that we're going to be talking about and now seen here highlighted in green. This is the renal medulla. And the renal medulla is divided into renal pyramids that are separated by the renal columns of the renal cortex. Now, the ascending and descending limbs of the loops of Henle, as well as the collecting ducts nephrons, are located in the renal medulla. This video is not over yet. Continue watching now the full video at KenHub.com. We have lots more videos like this one available to our premium members on our website, not to mention all the fun quizzes, related articles, and Atlas sections. So click on the button in the middle to watch the full-length video and master anatomy.